Hello there, my name is Michael. In this video, I'm going to be telling you about Telegram, the features it has in the chat, how to send your location, the emoji, and how to send a silent message. Please subscribe to my channel and leave a comment. And if you do that, I will mention your name in my next video. I'm going to show you how you can schedule your message on Telegram and also send a silent message first you type your message hello friend now you long press on this blue arrow just give it a long press and you can see we have a additional menu appeared i say schedule message send without sound you can also send a message without making a sound so right now we're going to click on schedule a message then in schedule a message you can choose the day which is this or the hour and minute and if you look at up here right here beside the three dots we can also click that say click dot and says send when uh, online so you can also send a message immediately the person comes online so now i'm gonna schedule this message okay to be sent okay let's put it on this then click send today you can see the time on this blue um, button down here so just click on it then wait for the time it merely eats the time of uh, it to send the message so let's wait and see so you can see the message has been scheduled and if you move your arrow down you can see right here the message okay right now i'm going to show you how you can send a silent message to a friend okay first we have to go back so this is our scheduled message we can also send a silent message Then long press on this blue arrow. Then say send without sound. Then now I'm gonna show you how you can can send a file. Now telegrams allow you to send a file size up to two gigabytes in the in in the new updates, and you can also send video files up to two gigabytes in the new update that is really large compared to other messaging apps so first you come here and click on file then it gives you your, your internal storage external storage Wants you to choose where the file is located at. So I'm going to choose. I'm going to choose my external storage. Okay. So these are my pictures. I'm going to show you. If you want to go back, click on this first um, folder appearing up here. If you click it, you're going to go back to your other folders so just click on it and see i'm back to my other folders then you can look for it okay so these are my files so i can send this um pdf file just click on the pdf file you can see it. then click send if you know, the send down here beside this blue arrow 
okay beside this blue arrow you can see this one because that's the number of files I've chosen so if I keep clicking you see the number keep increasing 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 so I'm gonna show you we're just gonna send one so just click on this blue arrow if you want to add a caption or a message to it just click add a caption then click on this blue arrow to send it done and you have sent your file now if you want to send a video on telegram automatically um, just come to this a pin sign this one right here once beside the audio just click on it all your files pictures and videos are out already if you want to send a video just click on this you can see number one then click send I have to send a video file. Don't forget to use the location function on Telegram. You need to put on your location right here. You can see that has to come on. Telegram users can send each other live location just like WhatsApp. Live location allows the receiver to track the sender in real time for a set amount of time when they are on the move. However, with Telegram, both parties can also set proximity alerts. These are mini alerts that will ring when another user gets close. You can for instance, set up a proximity alert for when your friend gets within a 50 meters radius of you at the mall so you can start looking for them around you. Okay, now I'm going to show you how it, it works. Click the pin icon beside the speaker. Once you click it, it gives you you a picture of your gallery you can see your pictures and videos right here look down you see the location the green icon click on it now if you look at it said send my okay I need to enable my GPRS click enable then click use location icon right here then go back it's loading you can see on the blue beside the blue icon it says loading so now you can send your friend it's done So now you can send your friend a location, but they might not be able to track you, but they will see where you are on the map. That is the first one, this blue one. If you just click on it, and you can see, you can send your location where you are to a friend. Now let's go back again. Click on the green. Underneath the blue, it says share my live location now you can share your live location so that your friend can see as you're moving maybe you're on the road your friend will be able to see where you are live if you click on it now you can set a time for how long you want them to see your live location as you are moving for 15 minutes for one hour or for eight hours 
I'm gonna leave it on 15 then share so if you notice here it has 15 I said live location so so it means that your friend will be able to see where you are live and could be able to track you if you want to leave a comment on the map just move it to the left you can see the message then you can type hi then send clicking on the blue arrow that's it and if you want to delete it does a long press and you can see a blue tick mark a green tick mark at the side you can also take the others long press take Q take Q take Q then come up here and this trash can uh, icon click it he said are you sure you want to delete this message click into the box tick the box then click on delete and it's gone subscribe to my channel and leave a comment and i will give you a shout out in my next video so click that and from here you can see gallery files if you click gallery to show you all your pictures files to show you all your files location we give you the location where you are which you can send to a friend contacts you can to send a contact to a friend just click on it and send I can send a contact on telegram Then music, just to have the option of music, just click on the music icon. Let's, let's view all your audio. See, all your audio is shown right there. If you come up here, okay, if you come up here, you can see the three dots. Just click on it. Can make calls, video calls, search. Maybe you're searching for a message. You go to a friend and search for it. You can clear your history, mute notification, and delete your chats. If you click on the picture, if you click on the name, you can view the phone number and the name the username of the account if you come up here and click the three dots you can block the user share the contact edit the contact delete it start secret chats you can see right here or you can add this contact this chat to your own screen so that if you want to chat with the person, you just click on the icon. Let me show you. Just click on it. Add home screen. Add automatically. So I can see it right here. See it right here. So you click on it and get back to the chat. You can also delete it if you don't want this contact from telegram to be on your own screen just click on it long press then move it to the x and that's it deleted telegram has great emojis that you can use Right here. See, you can 
said hi in emoji bye cool yeah, really nice emoji in telegram and you can also get more if you want 